Now, wow. The kind of way they happen to our country, eh? And our government just, they keep blind eye and deaf ear, like say, they know they see them. I be they not get solution to all this kidnapping, insecurity, where they everywhere. People no fit move freely again. Very soon, eh? <clears throat> if our leader no sit up, then go they go house to house, they pick people. If they no solve this insecurity issue, eh? 20,000 Naira kidnapping go there self. Guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Sonzi G's vlog. I greet you all, my subscribers. My people, this kind news, of where we they here today, eh? <clears throat> it no sweet at all. It no sweet for ear. Even since I hear her, eh, I never get myself. Who we'll know what she they pass through for their hand now? And we no get choice than to let Tuna know so that everybody go put her for prayer. Maybe through one of us, God go answer our prayer. I beg, make I just let the cat out of the bag. Now, a beautiful Nollywood actress, Nkone Wansuka, but her real name, Nariche Okonkwo. This Nkone Wansuka, where she the answer, no be her real name. Now, movie series where she acted as the main character. She can't become popular with the name. Even many people don't know her real name. So according to the gist, where we they here today, they say she did Asaba, where she they shoot movie. So after shooting, she can't call her cab driver to pick her up. On their way, they can't kidnap him. According to the story, where we they hear, oh, <laughs> they even say her kidnappers never call, nothing, nothing, or state what they want. Even in call itself, where they kidnap, nobody don't hear from her up to today. Mm, guys, it don't they very clear now. Say nobody they say for that country. Even actors guild don't come out. Can they say they don't know what thing they happen for their industry? Because in every three months, when they kidnap two of their members, now nah, Uncle Leon can't happen. I beg, make we they pray for Uncle Leon because we don't know how she did now. Nah. And what's in why not understand? Be say her person go go out to hustle for her daily bread, then go come kidnap the person. She know they into politics. Now nah, legit business she they do. All this is where they happen now because youth no get job. Student there for house for more than seven months now. Eh? Hunger day everywhere. Now all this is the make people they commit crime. Our leaders need to wake up from their slumber before things go spoil. Quata, quata. Guys, when I see this coming election, now fight for survival for all of us and even our unborn generation so that they don't go cause us for the mistake we make today because of bread and butter all these politicians they give us now. That is why we need to get it right this time now. Because if we miss this opportunity, I don't sure say we go get them again. No, I make with the pray also. May God they protect us. Because everywhere I don't read, everywhere I don't read. I not go lie you. I beg, make I allow you watch this video first. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. It's something just vlog. On Madi, Madi Usman, who spoke few days ago and try to speak lies against the Southern Church and against the Southerners. That we Northerners that are Christians will come to the South and will find it difficult to get a land to worship God. And I want to say to you, Madi Usman, you're a liar. That is not true. I am a Northerner and I am preaching here in the South. say that it's time up for the lies that some of you have been lying for all these years, 62 years, the end of your lie has come. You northern Christians and northern Muslims will prove to these wicked men and women that your time is up. And 2023, we are all going to vote for Peter Obi. threaten my son. I am not for you. I am for God and for the Nigerian people. Muslims here in the south are having their mocks. Nobody has stopped them. 
so don't tell lies to the northerners. And I stand here by the Spirit of the Lord. And I want to say to everybody, the glory of the Lord has been restored to the nation. I will not limit myself to the pulpit when you are suffering. I will declare the counsel of God over your life from the pulpit and I will move with you to the streets to fight your battle. Stewart, you and Tinibu and Atiku, we are retiring them from politics. Our mumu 